If you've been struggling to get your pull-up game on point, I'm gonna give you a super helpful tip. What you need to focus on is your eccentric motion you're having coming down from doing a pull-up. So for example, the box, keep yourself set up to a high position. And from here, slowly come down, count how many seconds it takes you to come down to the ground, step on the box, get yourself up above the bar again, count how long it takes for you to come down. All right. If you have trouble pulling yourself up, continue to do that and you will see improvements in your pull-ups. So All let's right, break let's it. break this down a little bit further. So week one, you're going to perform one test of your pull-ups. What you're going to do is hold yourself up and control your eccentric on the way down for as long as you can. For example, let's say that that is 15 seconds for test one. What you're going to want to do is multiply that number by two. You're going to get a total of 30 seconds or whatever number it is, you multiply it by two. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to perform as many sets as you need to in order to get to that 30 seconds. So whether that's three sets or four sets, however you need to do it, break it up and that's what you're gonna do. You're gonna do this three times a week for the next six to four weeks. So at the end of those six to four weeks, you're gonna retest again, see where your eccentric hold is, multiply it by two and repeat the process. After you do this for a certain number of times, you'll realize that this number will go up, this number will go up and you'll be able to hold for longer on the way down. And eventually you'll notice that you'll be able to pull up more and get more reps out of every single pull up to a full pull up. So go ahead and try this out, screenshot this, save it and use it next time you go to the gym and see how your pull up game changes.